Good afternoon, families, friends, distinguished guests, and most importantly, the graduating class of 2023. <clears throat> I am Shelley Graby, and I welcome you here today as the interim provost of Cowell College, the very first college established here at UCSC in 1965. Today, we are gathered here to celebrate a significant milestone in the lives of Cowell students. The culmination of years of hard work, dedication, commitment, and community. We are honored to be joined today by our Chancellor, Cynthia Larive and our student speakers, Leanne Eng and Owen Cooksey. I'd like to begin our ceremony with a land acknowledgement that recognizes the history and presence of indigenous peoples on this land. The acknowledgement we use at UCSC was developed in partnership with the Amamutsin Tribal Band Chairman, and it reads like this. The land on which we are gathered today is the unceded territory of the Awaswa-speaking Yupi tribe. The Amamutsin Tribal Band, comprised of the descendants of indigenous people who were taken to Mission San Santa Cruz and San Juan Bautista during Spanish colonization of the Central Coast, is today working hard to restore traditional stewardship practices on these lands and heal from historical trauma. It was on these lands that students at Cowell exercised our motto to pursue truth in the company of friends. And as we stand here together on the precipice of their and our future, I'm honored to address you on this momentous occasion. First, like any graduating class, the success of these students represents countless hours spent studying, sacrificing, and striving for excellence. However, where the class of 2023 differs is that you all started your college experience with the CZU wildfire that scorched nearly 80,000 acres of this land, forcing more than 70,000 people, including everyone at the UCSC campus to evacuate. We also had the PG&E blackouts where we lost power, the wildcat teaching strike that brought national attention, followed by a global pandemic that isolated you into Zoom rooms. And yet, you are, here you are. Your commitment to your education brought you to this moment, and you should be incredibly proud of yourselves. <clears throat> Let us not forget the countless individuals who also supported all of us on this journey. Parents, families, friends, lovers, mentors, housemates, grandparents, guardians, staff, professors, all who were sources of strength and encouragement. People who may have believed in us even when we doubted ourselves and provided the love and support we needed to succeed. One of the biggest burdens confronting you right now as graduating students who are about to shove off from this land in the Redwoods is the question of what you're going to do next. Many students come to my office with an overwhelming sense of fear around this. Some of it comes from the anticipation of confronting a new world, one that's not full of books and coffee shops and banana slugs and redwoods and parties, but the fear may also come from expectations. Expectations you have for yourself, expectations your family has for you, expectations that you make the right choices, not just about what job you'll get next, but about your life. I'm going to share one reflection, and that is trust your gut. If there's something you want to do, listen to yourself and bring a level of integrity and commitment to your interest and then work hard at pursuing it. Trusting yourself requires that you show up for yourself right now. Think about what you want to do right now, not what you might have done wrong before, like, oh, I should have studied more, changed my major, and not what you ought to do in the future. Oh, I should move home and make money, go to law school. Think more about what you want to set up for yourself right now and do it mindfully. Fully listen. Not just at the surface like, oh, I'm tired and I'm going to go kick it at the beach. Not like that. But fully listen to what you want for yourself and then put the building blocks in place. Even if it's not what you thought you were supposed to be doing. Do it knowing that it wouldn't be without challenges setbacks or even mistakes, but do it just like you did here at UCSC when the challenges were opportunities for growth. Do it knowing that you're ready and able to trust your gut. Whatever you choose, bring integrity and commitment to that interest and work hard at it. 
Your degree is going to be like an investment that pays off over time, but not just for your own gain. The skills you've acquired to be awarded the degree you are receiving today weren't transferred to you simply for your own self-growth, but also in part for the potential you have to make a contribution. You have learned critical thinking skills. You've learned how to be wise consumers of information. As Cowell graduates, you've learned about your place in this world and what sort of issues confront you. You are on the leading edge of a very different world than the one you were born into. As incoming students at Cowell, you all took our core course called Imagining Justice, where you learned to think critically about themes related to justice, equality, and freedom. As the class of 2023, what will you do about these issues? Our generation has left you a global world challenged by environmental crises and political strife. What role will you play in this world? We have trained you to be engaged citizens of the world. In fact, when it comes to thinking about global issues and social change, UCSC is a place like no other. In my mind, I am working and you are graduating from one of the most unique universities in the world. This is an iconic place. We have big names come through. We produce influential speakers and thinkers. You cannot come here and not be changed. There's a legacy in this forest and on this land. Take it with you. Think big, don't settle, and make yourselves proud. <laughs> Next, I'm going to introduce to you two of our student speakers. Our first speaker is Owen Cooksey. Owen was a history major, a member of the Cowell Student Senate, a recipient of a Dean's Award for his scholarship, and recently won the Carl Lamb Short Story Prize. Leanne Eng majored in psychology. She worked as an alumni engagement intern, a psychology peer advisor, and a Cowell peer advisor, and all the while received high enough marks to be on the Dean's List. So please join me in first welcoming Owen to the podium. I will try to be brief today. Um, it's less about the diplomas and the awards and more to celebrate the achievement of these students who have finished out a tremendous education in what a historian might describe as difficult circumstances and an editor might describe as ridiculous circumstances. Um, and these students who now await their futures with maybe a little less anxiety than they await the parties that are going to happen immediately after I stop talking. You will forgive me for being a little bit trite. When they asked me to speak about my experience as a Cowell student, it took me a while to figure out what that meant to me. Um, in the four years since I was told that Cowell College would be my home, things have changed so dramatically and with very little time to really process what that meant. We didn't have four golden years on an old college green. We had two years of pandemic and four years of struggle that made it very difficult to feel that we had that college community with us and all the more so as we moved off campus, as we changed majors, as we changed goals, and we set our sights beyond this institution. And yet none of that stopped us from building the community that we wanted, and we did not build it alone. We are grateful for the parents and for the families who are here. We are grateful for um, those who support us here now. We are grateful for our program staff and for our academic staff who were there along the way. And above all, we are thankful for our fellow students, and we are proud to celebrate with them today. This university sometimes, this university which is sometimes overwhelmed by its depth of resources and its massive and fluent student body, it's, it's very easy to feel intimidated and to find it hard to find our place. And Cowell College, for many of us, was a place to find our footing. It was large enough to support us, it was small enough to care for us. This college was not our only home, but it gave us each the tools to build the homes and the community for ourselves. We come from El Centro, we come from Eureka, we come from everywhere else. And everyone else had a unique experience of this college and of this university. We found in, we've found internships, we've done research, we've done independent research, and, and we've made the best of our time here. Um, despite only spending a couple of years together, we've shared experiences as colleagues, as students, as neighbors, and as friends, which 
I think sets Cowell students apart an absolute determination to pursue our goals with tenacity and with creativity and a willingness to find community in anything, whether that is our school, whether that is our sports, whether that is our homes, and whether that is our work. And today, we celebrate the achievements of all that hard work in the classroom and in the field. Today, we celebrate leaving college behind, knowing that our independence is an opportunity to pursue fellowship and deepen, deepen connections in the community beyond these four walls. I have no doubt, given what we've been through in four years of college, that all of these graduates and all of us will be ready for what happens in the next 20. I'm sure that we'll continue to pursue truth and to invite the company of friends wherever we find ourselves. Thank you. Thank you, Owen. And now please help me welcome Leanne Eng to the podium. Good evening to the Cowell class of 2023. It is an honor to be speaking on behalf of my fellow graduates. First, I would like to thank faculty, staff, friends, family, and everyone who has come out today to celebrate such a momentous occasion. I would also like to acknowledge your dedication to our education and growth you have continued to challenge and inspire your students acting as the motivation behind our success. To my fellow graduates, I invite you to look back and reflect on the incredible journey that has brought us to this very moment. For years, we have trekked this breathtaking campus and its countless hills. We held on for our dear lives in terribly crowded buses that almost always smelled a little funky we scavenged for calories and caffeine at our dining halls and somehow survived all of the seasons. Enrollment season, midterm season, final season, and for some of you, allergy season. We did this all while overcoming our own personal struggles and setbacks, juggling part-time jobs, unpaid internships, maintaining positions in campus organizations, and participating in sports teams. And along the way, we created beautiful, lifelong memories. We cultivated friendships with strangers who now know us like the back of their hand, and we made awe-inspiring discoveries, whether through hours of research in a dedicated lab or seeing a banana slug for a very first time. We fell in love with people, places, and things we shared brain-altering moments of laughter and joy, and we took advantage of this beautiful scenery and bloomed alongside the flowers. We thrived. We learned to enjoy life. Some of us, a little too much. And we made it through this incredible journey, but most definitely not without bumps, scratches, or scars that some of us may have to carry throughout our lives. You are seen and heard and I am so proud to be graduating with you today. I encourage you to take in this pivotal moment and celebrate the triumphs you achieved, both academic and personal. Bask in all your glory and congratulate one another because without a doubt, you deserve it. As we leave here today, I want to remind you that our education has given us access to the wisdom and skill set needed for creating positive change, big or small. We will inevitably stumble and make the wrong decisions, but we owe it to our younger selves not to make the same mistakes as the people in power from past generations have. We cannot forget the responsibility that comes with our education because we are the next generation of parents, educators, leaders, influencers, etc. And as daunting as this may seem, I encourage you to take on this challenge with the same spirit you carried throughout your time here. To the Cowell class of 2023, you have what it takes to achieve great things, just like what you're doing here today. And we're all rooting for you. Thank you and congratulations.
Thank you, Leanne. And now we've finally arrived at that moment where we present our graduates. Owen Leslie Cooksey. Alexander Torres. Christine Mace. Shinosuke Hoku Ross. Jennifer Panetta. Armand Agopia. Karthik Pradeep. Ryan Daniel Mick. Abraham Guerrero Tello. Jacqueline Ida Bersalia. Sky Yonehiro. Elia Futuhi. Charles Bailey. Christopher Villegas. Ethan Cassania. Alejandra Garibay. Jolie Michelle Wolf. Bailey Emiko Matsumoto. Orazio Bagno.
Ethan Reichwald. Skyler Train Smith. Rachel Nicole Scott. Alexi Juanita Mejia. Jacques Daniel LeMay. Leo Greeland. <laughs> Amando Merlin Pop. <laughs> Tamara Echevarria. Kylie Storin. Matthew Lara. Ethan Bautista. Eliana Reyes. Robert Isaac Cuellar. <laughs> Mariam Khatib Sadeh. Nathan J. Surendran. <laughs> Elise Turkovich. <laughs> Max Gisasola Jacobs. Logan James McCraw. <laughs> Niccolo Lewis Abate. <laughs> Rai Bachich. Joseph Alexander Guzman. Elizabeth Ann Lundgren. Kevin Dwee Long. Samuel Hirsch. Woo! Remington Plishka. Right, 
Alexandra Jane Gaines. Sam Bay. Ina Park. Lynn Yang. Ellen Ka Eun Kim. Jeremiah Moa. Alice Maria Moore. Nyla Cherie Smith. Hannah Mart. Summer Fluger Prouding. Wen Hao Sun. Samuel David Suhu. Michael Souza Jr. Eric Andrew Holstein. Nicholas Nasser. <laughs> Kenneth Fan. Ralph Calquit Miller the Third. Gerard J. De Los Santos, Jr. Cameron Wu. Hazel Uber Kellogg. Kennedy Dutra. <laughs> Darren Green. Haley Elizabeth Meese. Cameron Elizabeth Chu. Cameron! 
Bennett Jones. Christopher Jensen. Dana Velasquez. Clarence Ortega. Madeline Linguet. Hawass Kaderi. Kimiko Paulina Rossi. Axel Nateras. Calder John Wilson. Willis Clayton Stankowski. Brandon Liu. Andre Asadi. Soren Nyholm Larson. Sam Walsh. Lindsay Trapp. Duraj Gurum. Kevin Dow. Eric Blaine Wagenbrenner. Jasmine Morphine Guzman. Rachel Goodale. Chloe Noel Tingloff. <laughs> Christian Moises Alvarado. <laughs> Jaden Shore Songi. Matthew James Minshaw. Safina Mann.
Samantha Ann Strona. Amelia De Andres. Max Noble Manwaring Mueller. Angelina Winnie Prakash. Harjot Singh. Trevor Christopher Pickett. Trevor! Jack Hunter Myers. Shreya Taman. Paloma Segura. <laughs> Margarita Rodriguez. <laughs> Jasmine Rodriguez. Shivani Moda. <laughs> Owen James Schneider. <laughs> Jasmine Cecilia Figueroa. Sarah Niles. Jillian Rose Mendoza. Riley Kathleen Birch. Nicholas Dead Gary. Redima Sai Rupakula. Justin Lee. Jing Chi Sun. Bo Shuan Ma. Ryan Marco Fishman. <laughs> Lucas A. Mathias. <laughs> Yusuf Abdul Kader.
Dustin James Creech. Peter H. Hahn, Jr. <laughs> Queenie Lee. <laughs> Cheyenne Fu. Dylan Evenfield. Nicholas Thomas. <laughs> Tristan Chu. Julian Ray Swartz. Sachin Dennis Parikadin. Isaac Lopez. Aria Parik. Gianna Sage Lugo. Marco Antonio Segura. Shane Hawley. Madeline Marie Michael. <laughs> Manny Stone Fluss. Liam McCool Fahey. Alicia Elizabeth Pites. Awesome, Ian Otis Anderson. Spencer Miller. <laughs> Julian Sage Dana Meglino. <laughs> Gavin Faridi. Maxwell Dean Callahan. Nolan Michael Moy.
Eli Edward Shia. Benjamin Alexander Rubin. Toby Aaron Schwartz. Aaron Zelig Steinberg. Ivan Ji Hing Pang. <laughs> Isaiah Roberts. <laughs> Amaya Palayo. New Suan Hin. Kabia Umeyal Nachiapin. <laughs> Sulema Martinez Rosette. Amelia Rose Ensman. Maxime Joel Carbonell Kiamtia. <laughs> Charles Davison Rhodes Field. <laughs> Matthew Daxner. Miguel Shamelashvili. Ethan Walker Hurst. <laughs> Luca Popescu. Kevin Hugh. Yeah! I love you, Oppa. Mateen Rahimi. Samuel Allen Garcia. Jade Gorey. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! Let's go, Jade! Leah Baker Vanek. Yeah! Claire E. Tusigna.
John G. Gettinger. Devin Room York. Logan Samuel Chacon. William Dong Wu Han. Austin Lindsay Rogers. <laughs> Megan Lan No. <laughs> Allegra Odette Negrete Mendoza. Avery Finch. Ezra Jack Mander. Marissa Danielle Fuentes. Ethan Starr. <laughs> Patrick Wilson Dew. <laughs> Matthew David McDonald. Matthew Eidenberger. Anish Pahilajani. Angela Hong. Reem Amir. <laughs> Kai Allen Nogueira Donnacht. <laughs> Skylar Bettina Sexton. Ariana Engdahl. Jackson Burke. David Park. Devin Jade Cropper.
Christopher Vo. Alex Shea. Matthew William Lucan. Morgan Staggs. Leo Liss. Andrea Beatriz Arevalo. Lorena Hernandez Rivera. Ivan Sotelo Briseno. Lucy LaFrance Wall. Frank Kwong Hong Le Nu. Alvin de Guzman Sanda. Kimberly Suzanne McLaren. Zion McMahon. Nicole Ward. Gabriela Rios. Envy Lau. Azmi Ji Chung Lo. James McDonnell Nakahara. Nick Buddy. Stephen Andrew Markarian. <laughs> Javier Alberto K. <laughs> Mateo Xavier Echeveste.
Fernando Yapet Soto Reyes. Andrew Joseph Antunes. <laughs> Abigail Bonnie Vasquez. <laughs> Frida Pensamiento. Sebastian Daisuke Basiri. <laughs> Soraya Reese. <laughs> Carol Lius. Hope Takahashi. Chi Wei Shao. Sierra Dunaway. Ryan Le Huang. Juan Cerritos Lara. Jesus Mendez. Rajveer Singh Tour. Yeah, yeah. Nicholas Alexander Garcia. Yeah. Niall Kincaid. Adilene Navarro Rafael. Evan Andrew Daniels. Guy Thomas Edwards. Christy Ho. Blaze Callahan Goldstein. Ella Sadie Schultz. Anthony George Millichen. <laughs> Alexander Ion Carabulia. <laughs> Anthony Straznikov.
Batia Blank. Robin Elazar Menabi. Christopher Xavier Shiano Voren. Diego Alfaro Juarez. Iraya A. Watson. Avalon Nasalina Burbank Bruno. Ihan Lu. Kaylee Deanne Garcia. Mara Bautista. Yoav Halperin. Jared Kalahi. Victor Wa Wong. Sean Andrew Simons. Ryan Colby Peterson. Riley Min Kuo. Shafiq Ahmad Nomer. Tong Tian. Matt Siosin. Giovanni Lomeli Mejia. Tuan Wen. <laughs> Matthew Yu Song Lu. Leanne K. Castro Ang. <laughs> Isabel Thezin Vo. <laughs> Jackie Yam.
Chloe Nguyen. Harlene Virk. Vishnu Nair. Kevin Kang Bui. Ethan Elwood Kingery. Connor Lee Branson. Rory Kai Moninger. Gavin Breeze Cox. Caitlin Lauren Herm. <laughs> Sasha Renee Ballou. Louise De Jesus Lason. Nikolai Vetrovec. Nathan Emil Link. Abril Kekilani de la Mora. Melody for me. Ethan Andrew Smith. Hector Torres. Emily Rose Washburn. Zoe Tespa Michael. Jimmy John Wei Lu. Jeremy J. Lorelli. Madison Ramirez Huang. Jesus Fernando Enriquez. Guadalupe E. Pacheco Gomez. Lucy Louise Dills. <laughs> Samantha Grace Pollock. Yes, 
Xing Yan Chen. Camila Daniel Santiago. <laughs> Hillary Ash Tai. <laughs> Alexandra Peach Beto Weeks. Luis Antonio Guerrero Cruz. <laughs> Fernando Daniel Ortiz. <laughs> Timothy Daniel Fitzpatrick. Anthony Kim. Cami Mun Yi Tan. Jackson Daly. Malia Sarmiento Mosser. Genesis Lucia Castaneda Munoz. Ravinder Singh. Edward Regal Peterman. Daisy Diana Brambila. Michael Robert Iso. Christopher Torres. <laughs> Maylin Dolan. <laughs> Leslie Aguillon Altimirano. Rahul Ayer. Suki Kwan. Athirath Dara. Chidin Ma Onyakanu. Willow Kai Longwinter. Christine Abrahamia.
Joseph Sebastian Lowe. Matthew Vicente Herrera. Karvika Yadav. Brandon Van Toe. Noreen Hackle. Graduates of Powell College Class of 2023. You accomplished so much in your time at UC Santa Cruz, but the best is yet to come. This concludes our 2023 commencement ceremony.